हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट ए ओपन सोर्स टूल व्हिच इज देयर फॉर बिल्डिंग इलेक्ट्रॉन एप्लीकेशंस सो द टूल नेम इज इलेक्ट्रॉन फिडल सो बेसिकली दिस इज अ गुई टाइप ऑफ अ टूल वेयर यू कैन जस्ट राइट साइमेंटेनियस कोड फॉर मेकिंग इलेक्ट्रॉन एप्लीकेशन डेस्कटॉप एप्लीकेशन एंड इफ यू सर्च इफ यू गो टू गूगल हियर एंड जस्ट टाइप हियर इलेक्ट्रॉन फिडल सो बेसिकली दिस इज अ टूल हियर This tool can be found on, on the official website of electronjs.org/fiddle. So this is a tool. It is the very easiest way to get started with building electron applications. So you can see that you can just download this tool here by clicking this download button, and it will redirect you to the GitHub repository page. And here you can just download the .exe file, either for 32-bit or 64-bit computer. I have already installed it. This is the tool here. If I just click on the run button, it will instantly uh, run the electron application like this. So you will see the hello world screen here. You need not have to install electron from the command line or build it from scratch. So you can also publish your project also to GitHub like this by clicking the publish button. And uh, you can even install previous versions of electrons. So you can see that all the versions are there. You can just test it. in this tutorial we will be building a very simple app with the help of i will not uh, make any changes to main.js i will just uh, write here index.html code here let me just create some space here and uh, inside this uh, i will delete this and uh, i will include bootstrap for the bootstrap cdn and click on the very first link which comes in and you just need to copy paste the cdn just after the head you can just have a link tag link relative to style sheet and href will be equal to that link paste it and now we just need to have our dev class of container so heading will be simply a random image using unsplash api like this you need to close the heading also after that we will be having a simple form inside the form guys we will be using the form group class of bootstrap so form group so inside this div we will be declaring a simple input field which we will be input type will be text the class will be form control this is again a bootstrap class and i will be giving a id to it of search like this so close this tag and then we will be having a simple button also so again we will be wrapping this inside form group inside this we will be having a button btn btn danger search so now if i run the app you will see uh a interface like this random image using unsplash api here you can just so enter a search term and click the search button and now we also need to ins uh, include jquery for uh, making the request uh, this is a uh, cdn here so here you can just uh, copy paste the cdn here so copy the cdn like this and just after the bootstrap you can just include this script tag and now basically guys we will be writing our renderer code here 
for that just before we can just give it a id to the form here form element id form like this and just after this just after this form we will be having a simple image tag where we will be displaying our image i will be giving a id to it of image like this so just close this image tag and now we will be writing our renderer code renderer.js we have included this file right here at the bottom you can see that inside the script we are requiring it and now we will be writing our javascript code we will get the form we will be adding a event listener so when the form submits like this we will be executing a function which will have the event as a object and then we will be calling event prevent default so basically it will prevent the auto submission of the form and then we will be getting the search term search document dot get element by id inside this we will pass the id that we have given which is search and we will get the value dot by dot value and now we will be using the unsplash api to get a random image so let me just show you the endpoint this is endpoint guys so i will just copy paste the endpoint so if you just open this it will be uh, giving you a random image based upon a search term and uh, now i will just go to my image here Oh, uh, this! I will construct the URL like this. Paste a URL, and this is HTTP source dot unsplash dot com slash random, and here you can just specify the size also. So I will be specifying four hundred, four hundred, and in the search term, I will be concatenate the search term like this. and now basically guys i need to just uh, target our image tag we will get the image by document dot get element by id which is image in this case and then we will just image dot source we will just manipulate the source attribute of the image to the url like this that's it so this completes the application and now basically if i again rerun the application if i enter in any sort of search let me just enter computer click on search and now you will see that it is fetching a random image if i again search now it will fetch another image I think that you really need to rerun the application for that too. If I change the search term to let's suppose cricket, cricket. If I click search, you will see that it is fetching the cricket image. So in this tutorial, guys, we have built a random image using Unsplash API in Electron application. So this is a desktop app. So thanks so much for watching this video.